Hi, this is Shoe Rainer here at the Shoe Rainer Drawing School, and today is the 1st of January 2011. I was up late trying to remember what day it is. So, uh, and today, 1st of January, is a good day for making New Year's resolutions. And I made one New Year's resolution, is that I'm going to set an example. Um, and I'm going to try and do a l drawing from life every single day in a sketchbook. I've got this lovely sketchbook here from papiro.co.co.uk and uh, and it's oh it's a lovely leather bound Italian leather and it's gorgeous it, it is nice to have nice sketchbooks it kind of you know is part of what it's all about isn't it and uh, I, I started I started before the new year trying to do things so I, I'm hoping this is in focus I think it is uh, so this is my little computer mini mouse I did that on the 21st, and I've done that on the 23rd, so I missed a day. That's my um, stapler, <laughs> uh, I missed a page, and then that's my jam jar. Have I got that here? Yes, yeah, jam jar, water, jam jar of water that I use for doing watercolours. Um, and then today, I've started doing a seashell, and uh, and I'll show you why I'm doing a seashell in just a moment. So, the th why, why do a, a sketch every day like that? Um, because. Uh, because you're probably not doing it anyway. <laughs> and drawing from life is really, really good. And doing that little bit every day is really good. And I keep saying practice, 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 practice. And I really mean it. Practice is at the root of everything. If you want to do anything good in life, you've got to practice at it. And uh, while you're doing it, it's kind of up here and you're kind of there doing it. But the more you practice, you're going to get it to the back of your brain and it just becomes habit. Um, and it just becomes something that you can do. Sports people, dancers and everything, they have this term muscle memory and dancers, they do that la 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 la, la every day um, until in the end their, their hands and their feet make those shapes. High jumpers can just do that twist, whatever it is that they have to do because they do it again and again and again and again. Repetition, which is deadly, deadly boring at times. Uh, but but it does liberate you and free you in the end because you kind of can just do things. The boring stuff, you, in the end, you can just do without thinking and then you can put all the creativity on the top of, of that layer of expertise that you've built up through practice, practice, practice. So I'll show you about that, uh, wh wh why I've done that seashell uh, in this. I'm going to change the video now, so I'll follow on from now. OK, see you in a moment. Okay, well this is on the wall of my studio and this is an old printer's type case where they used to put all the lead uh, letters in each of these little boxes. And I've got all sorts of weird things in here. I don't know if this focuses if I do that, does it? What does that do? Uh, and I've got seashells and, 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 and fur cones and <laughs> acorns. And that's a funny little thing that comes from a magnolia tree. More acorns, sort of seaweed things and seashells and... Uh, I, I, and I love these things which are kind of moss that grows on trees uh, that's an old peeled tangerine thing there <laughs> with tangerine skin uh, I've got fur cones this is a thing I picked up off the beach so lots of things I pick up off the beach and things I just put them up here so I'm going to use these kind of as the inspiration for uh, drawings I'm going to kind of draw one of these each day so that's kind of a thing to get me started until I get another idea of things I'd like to draw and uh, and what I'm also going to try to do is, is I'm going to draw them and then see that having drawn them if they can inspire me to kind of come up with a design around it or something like that just just to take it from a straight drawing into something else again so each day I will kind of work on that and uh, and maybe we'll be able to kind of if everybody else does it then we maybe you know we'll be able to share what everybody does somehow uh, but we'll cross that bridge when we come to it <laughs> you got to get and start start drawing first and uh, remember one drawing every day uh, which is it's a hard, tough tough thing to do so uh, so there we go that's how I'm gonna start so that's what I'm gonna be doing for the next uh, month or so working away on my little box of tricks up there and uh, and, and maybe at the end of the month I'll show you what I've done just to show that I've actually done it <laughs> so, so I hope you're gonna do the same too and if you like this idea then keep coming back to the Shoe Rainer Drawing channel on YouTube and www.shoe-tube.com where you can see all these videos through all the school filters on your computers and whiteboards 
and uh, what else can I say? Practice, practice, practice. <laughs> Keep drawing. Happy New Year, and I'll see you next time.